Hello friends, today we are going to discuss about pressure vessel head. Different types of heads are used in the industry. What are heads? Heads are nothing but the ends of the cylindrical process vessel which are used to close before putting into operation and this is done by means of heads and the closers. There are different types of shapes. The principal types are flat plates and the form, form flat heads, spherical heads, ellipsoidal heads, they are also called as elliptical head, hemispherical heads and conical heads. Now the selection of a particular type that depends upon the different factors like process temperature, pressure, nature of the material to be handled, product obtained, position of the vessel whether it is horizontal or vertical and nature of the supports and above all the economy is the most uh, important parameter while selection of the head. The first one that is flat heads. The flat covers are generally used for manholes in low pressure vessel operation or to bind any flange opening. They can also be used as closer for small diameter vessel operating at low pressure. From the fabrication point of view, this is the simplest type of head to construct just by cutting a circular piece from a flat plate. This is another type of uh, flat heads, that is form flat heads. This is also uh, form, but here there is a gradual change in the shape at the corner and which res results in the reduction of the localized stresses and which is very important parameters. So this head is very economical to fabricate and it finds a number of applications in closing the heads uh, ends of the horizontal storage vessels at atmospheric pressure to store the liquid having low vapor pressure such as oil, kerosene etc. The next one is flange shallow dish and flange standard dish head. So dish heads consist of two radii namely crown radius and knuckle radius. Crown radius is the radius of the dishing and the knuckle radius is the radius at the corner which changes or which use to avoid the sudden change in the shape. If the crown radius, if the crown radius is greater than the shell outside diameter, the head is known as shallow dish head. On the other hand, if the crown radius is equal to or less than the shell outside diameter of the head, then it is known as standard dish head. The head is provided with a straight flange portion, this SF portion of 15 to 20 millimeter, so that the approved change in the geometry that is called as a discontinuity area is avoided and hence the head can be uh, easily welded or joined to the cylindrical shed and this uh, localization of stresses at that area can be reduced. Due to small inside corner that is knuckle radius localized stresses are very high and so the application of such heads are found in the construction of vertical process vessel for low pressure or horizontal cylindrical storage tank for volatile fluid such as naphtha and gasoline. To increase the pressure rating of flange and dish head, the localized stresses at the inside corner of the head must be reduced. As per IS code, inside corner radius that is RK or knuckle radius should preferably be 10% uh, of the inside diameter of the vessel or the head and also inside crown radius that is RC should not be greater than the outside diameter DO of the vessel or the head. Head of these types are used for the pressure intensity in the range of 0.1 to 1.5 mega Newton per meter square. The next one is elliptical dish head. These types of head are generally recommended for the uh, process vessel operating above 1.5 mega newton per meter square. Most of the standard elliptical dish head are manufactured on 2 s to 1 ratio of major to minor axis but this ratio can be maximum 2.6 s to 1. 
hemispherical hairs. For a given thickness, these types of hair is strongest among the form hairs. These hairs can be used to resist approximately twice the pressure rating of an ellipsoidal dish hair of the same thickness and the diameter. The degree of forming and the accompanying cost are higher than any of all the common types of heads. So this type of head is perhaps the most expensive but it is widely used in heavy duty high pressure vessel due to the fact that most efficient use of the material is achieved. The next one is a conical head. Conical heads are used as a bottom for the variety of process equipment like evaporators, spray dryers, crystallizers, settling tank, etc. The particular advantage lies in the accumulation and the removal of solids from such equipment. When the apex angle is more than 60 degree, it is necessary to provide a transition knuckle radius. Cone having apex angle 60 are commonly used for the removal of solids. These heads can be formed by different manufacturing process where it includes forming, pressing, spinning, bending, welding, post weld heat treatment, assembly and painting. So these all the manufacturing process can be carried out certain types of uh, machine. Forming can be uh, hot, warm or cold forming. Pressing can be used with the help of pressing machine to give a particular shape. Similarly, spinning, bending, welding and PWHT is also carried out by such machines. And after that, the, all the parts are assembled together and after getting that, uh, the painting of the uh, heads can be carried out to form the final head. Heads at a glance. So flat plates these are used as a cover for manholes channel covers or heat exchangers form flat heads cheapest types of form head use is limited to the low pressure and small diameter vessel standard torispherical head that is dish head most commonly used up to operating pressure of 15 bar ellipsoidal head they are used above 15 bar pressure intensity hemispherical head these are the strongest shapes and accommodates about twice the pressure than ellipsoidal head of the same thickness. But the manufacturing cost is maximum of all the form heads. Thank you.